Showdown at NBC. So what's going on between Jay and Conan? Let's break it down. Once upon a time, all was well at the NBC late night lineup. Jay Leno hosted the Tonight Show at 11:30, followed by his heir apparent Conan O'Brien. Until NBC exec Jeff Zucker got a bright idea: let's put Jay Leno in prime time. Zucker decided to pull the whole nighttime chat lineup forward. This way, Jay Leno would get a new show at 10 p.m., while Conan gets his dream job as promised: the host of the Tonight Show. And by replacing expensive scripted programming with a talk show, NBC should save a boatload of money, right? Why hasn't anybody thought of this before? And what could possibly go wrong? Unfortunately, the audience didn't get the memo. Critics trashed the Jay Leno show, and the ratings tanked. Meanwhile, Conan's not finding his feet at the Tonight Show. The audience started switching off. After seven months, Zucker decided to pull the plug on the experiment. NBC announced Jay will be back at 11:30 p.m. This would shove the Tonight Show into the next day. Conan put his foot down. In an open letter addressed to the people of Earth, he pretty much said, "Hell no, I won't go." Conan fought back by doing what he does best: cracking jokes. In fact, it was open season on NBC for both Jay and Conan. NBC management was getting insulted night after night on their own network. Soon, Jay and Conan started sniping at each other too. Ouch! Talk show rival hosts David Letterman and Jimmy Kimmel wasted no time in joining the fray. Soon, late night chat became trash talk central about late night chat. The audience couldn't get enough. Ratings shot up. Like Jay said, NBC wanted drama at 10. Well, they got it. Zucker tried to get O'Brien to fall in line by threatening to keep him off the air. The battle lines have been drawn. Are you with Leno's posse or with Team Coco? Well, Letterman and Kimmel made their loyalties clear, and increasingly, so has everybody else. This has been an Apple Action News animated roundup.